Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Mm -hmm. And it's about two o'clock, one fifty six. Yep, it's it's coming. Oh yeah. I kid you not guys. I just I got the boat moved over. We got that pulled up. Got the vet moved and I mowed this grass here where it was growing up around the vet and over there at the boat. I just pulled the tractor around back and came in and this is what started going on. So, yeah. Sweet. Look on top of the roof. Why? Because something hit it. Big tree limb. Big tree limb. Over by the vent. So it might be in the backyard. Yeah. Yeah, well, go ahead. No, you go ahead. You're the one that's filming. I was just trying to help the video. <laughs> I've got a camera here. Hold this. I can't take my camera out there. Well, I would look in the back, but it's over by the van. Probably in the backyard. Really? Yeah, really. I'm trying to make a film here. Well, that's part of the film. Or actually recording. Now everybody's getting into that now. It's not filming. There are no film. There's no film in them cameras nowadays. It's recording. Whatever. You get the idea. But uh, you just got that done just in time. I was telling them I just walked in, didn't I? Yeah. My uh, palm tree ain't moving, so we're okay, I think, with that thing. As long as it don't hit that boat. Wait, it's not even swaying. Yeah, that's what worries me. Yeah. I just put it over there. Like here? Oh my god. Hear that? Yeah. Something up there at the neighbors on top of the hill just blew over. Let's go in the backyard. Alright. Yeah, let's go in the backyard. I'll hold the camera so you can go out there. Yeah, let's. See what's happening out there. Whoa. Here, you better stay there. Here. Why? Oh, the rain. Because the camera can't get wet. Well, I'll buy you raincoats for it. You see it? Nope. I hear it. Oh, crap. The umbrella's up. Give me my camera. <laughs> wow. All right, guys, I'll be back with you here in just a minute. Yeah, it's in. Ooh, look at it. We're getting gusts. <laughs> Do you think so? How fast is this thing supposed to be? Up to 60. Ooh, ooh. Up to 60. <laughs> Oh, don't worry, he ain't going out there. <sighs> hey guys, I'll be back. <laughs> oh my god. Okay guys, we're going to move the Chevy. Um, I'm going to move it over here beside the vet. She's worried about the palm tree, so. Um, yeah, let's go do this. I got, I got you on my action camera, so. You probably fog up here for just a second. There we go.
should be all right here. There's the vet. There's mom's room, so. All right. Yep. Told Monkey the other night, I said, man, it's going to get bad. Nothing's going to get bad. Okay. And then she started looking at the weather report and said, oh, we need to go get water. We need to do this. I said, no, I ain't worried about it. Nothing's going to get bad. <laughs> yeah, but I didn't think it was going to get bad. Bad. <laughs> Whatever that means, Monk. All right. Let's go back in the house. I grabbed this camera because you know it's waterproof, so. Yeah. All right. Yeah, it's dark enough this thing kicked on. All right, you're getting fogged up. I'll be back with you. In a minute, guys. And that's I set the blue dot. Huh? Hot. Yep. Got some bad stuff right over top of us now. The hurricane's not gonna hit us, but yeah, we're gonna get some nasty stuff. We're under a tornado watch. We've been under a tornado watch, and we're gonna be under one till 6 a.m. And 18 miles west from us, they're already getting bad um, storm surges. They're expecting four to seven feet storm surge. And right here in our area, they're expecting five inches of rain. And through tomorrow, which is Monday, they're expecting around They're expecting around 16 inches. Um, not right in my area, but about 18 minutes west of me, which is Crystal River. So, man. So it's been like this since what, two o'clock? Just off and on, just wind blowing, and we it's not too bad here, but out front here. There's some stuff on the front of the Nissan there. That looks okay. Roof looks okay on this part. Looking pretty good out here. Hey, right, I'll be back with you. All right, see how dark it is over here on this street behind us? Power, um, their power's out. They just had a, I saw it, it was very bright. Just had a, 
uh, transformer blow, so wow. All right. Okay, guys, it's 2:35 a.m. Pretty nasty out. Got some winds. Uh, we are in the zone of 65 to 70 miles an hour gusts. Uh, supposed to make landfall about 8:30 in the morning, but it's not going to hit us directly but we're going to have some bad stuff we're supposed to have um, mainly a lot of flooding and uh, so all the like all the government offices in my county citrus county or are, are closed they're going to be closed uh, so yeah it's been just bucketing down and the wind's been blowing i just heard I heard thunder just a minute ago, right before I turned you on. It was about, uh, it lasted like five seconds long, man. But I didn't see, excuse me, I didn't see any lightning. I can't show you the trees, it's too dark. But they are really uh, <laughs> Yeah. This camera's amazing on wind noise. The Sony AX53. And I don't have a I don't have a wireless mic on this. It's just the mic from the camera, but it has a wind reduction setting on it. You can turn on and it does reduce the wind. Um it's phenomenal amazingly it reduces the wind a lot so if you hear wind in my like a lot of times you'll hear me i don't know if you can hear that but a lot of times you'll hear me say you know sorry about the wind and you don't actually hear it so you might hear that a little bit there but if you hear wind in this camera it's really really blowing so that's why a lot of times like i don't hear any wind <laughs> But, like, I'll show you the trees moving around stuff, but, so these cameras, they are amazing. Let's go out back. Ooh. Yeah, it's starting to pick up. Uh, it is, uh, is a hurricane, a Cat 1 hurricane right now. So I figure it's going to be a cat too by the time she makes landfall in the big bend area. I can't believe our umbrella is still up. see anything major down uh, I know over in there some tree limbs have been falling over there in the woods there but nothing in the yard yet other than some of these little tree branches and we got right over here we got some palm fronds down over there because of the palm tree of course There you go. Looks like there might be something down over there, but tree limb or something. He's just cat just scared the hell out of him. Go back up front.
So I'm pretty sure the doctor's offices aren't going to be aren't going to be open and I'm pretty sure that the carport people is not going to be able to make it tomorrow that's fine that's understandable so yeah that's the update it's getting pretty nasty it's nastier now than it was when we took the ride on the live stream if you guys saw the live stream but. My lens is soaked. Trying to get some of these trees blown around for you. I don't know if uh, I close my memory card slot so it doesn't get wet. I don't know if that'll help any. But yeah, it always happens at night here, so. I got some tree branches down over there, small ones, twigs and whatnot. So, hope if anybody's around what's well, going to be the impact zone. I hope everyone stays safe and are prepared. But unbelievably, we have not lost power yet. We have had some power surges and some flickering. Uh, but our power has stayed on. But yeah, it's, it's starting to get nasty now. It's not raining as hard as it was earlier, but the wind is, when we get this much wind right here where we're at, it's really blowing up there on top of the hill. Like I said, we're in the 60 to 70, or what is it, 65 to 75 mile an hour plus wind, gusts of wind, not sustained. So yeah, we're in a, Yep, it's um can I, there, can you guys see the rain? Yeah, I think you can see the rain there. And I'm getting breezes of warm air and cold air mixed and we're still under tornado watch until tomorrow evening. So uh, anything else develops I'll let you know and I'll kick you back on. I'll probably end up being up all night. <laughs> cat was standing there staring at me like what are you doing you're an idiot <laughs> there she is <laughs> but so I'll keep you posted right now we're safe we got plenty of provisions we got plenty of water plenty of sustainable food we've got many many ways to heat water and you know to cook we've got canned foods we've got dry goods stuff like that so we've got uh, we're set up pretty good so 
And she went, she got in her box. Let's see, let me turn you. That cat has played like that all day long. She wore Bruno out. <laughs> all right, I'm heading back in. Just wanted to update you guys. Okay guys, it's 4.04 and yeah, it's starting to get nasty now. Getting some uh, major gusts. It's wild because I can hear it going over top of me. Like when it blows real hard, when it gusts real hard. So it's like going over top of the trees. still raining it's not bucketing down it's like a real fine mist type rain but the wind is coming Yeah, but it's pretty well sustained there. I don't know if you can hear it. Oh. Big gust there. Let me get my other camera. 
Maybe you can hear the wind better with it. Now this camera don't have night vision, so and as you can see, it's not very good at night. Let me change some settings. Hang on. Yeah, I don't think that helped much, but maybe you can hear the wind now. Let me get a light. <clears throat> this is more of a spotlight. <clears throat> Let's go here and check this out. <laughs> oh, that's a cold rain. Whoa. All right, I gotta get back in the house. It's really coming down now. Whew. Dang. Whew. All right, guys. I'm going in and dry off and uh, I'll keep you posted. Yeah, it's definitely getting worse. Alright. Yep. We will rebuild. Okay, good morning everyone. It's 11.30, so um, I stayed up until it was about five o'clock, between five and five thirty. Everything just stopped. The rain stopped, wind stopped. Uh, we're getting some breeziness going on here. So it has passed us. We're fine. We do have some weather coming our way, but the uh, hurricane is, uh, it made landfall at a category one and um, it's right now it's kind of between Gainesville and Jacksonville um, there's 284,000 people without power there's 1500 uh, I turned the camera on here comes the cars there's 1500 flights canceled and uh, even though it wasn't a terribly bad storm, they're, you know, they're more worried about flooding because of the storm surge more than anything. But, you know, even a, a storm that wasn't, you know, that wasn't that bad uh, comes with a cost. <clears throat> there is one person killed, a 13-year-old boy. The young man was killed. A tree fell on a mobile home in Levy County, Florida, which um, which is around the Cedar Key area. So that's man, that's sad. But so we're going to. Uh, the carport as you can see is not here um, they won't be here for I think they're taking two days off so probably Wednesday um, 
or they're going to be off the next two days. So Wednesday or Thursday, they'll um, they'll be here to put the carport up. So I still have to. Um, okay, so I am going to my appointment, my stress test. I got to leave here in about an hour, so I'm going to go to my stress test. Now, I can't let you know anything because I won't know the results today. So, as soon as I find out something about that, you know, I'll make a video or I'll mention in one of my videos what's happening there, how everything's going, and I'll keep you guys posted on that. So, that was, you know, the documentation of the storm. Uh, it did turn into a hurricane, so, but we're fine. Um, there's just a couple palm fronds down out back. So we're, we're okay. We did well. You know, there's just some leaves and sticks down here and there. I can, I can mow over that stuff and mulch that up. So, all right, guys. Um, that, of course, came down off that tree there. So, I want to thank everyone for watching. Thanks all for all your thoughts and prayers. I appreciate it. And uh, live stream coming up next weekend. Maybe one this week. We'll see. But definitely got a live stream coming up next weekend. And uh, more about that as we get closer to the weekend. So, anyway, guys, thanks again. Appreciate it. Shea Bear, the myth, the man, the legend. I'm gone for now. We'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye, everyone. Take care. Be safe out there.